Uh, we're joined by Kev and two special guests here. Uh, we've just managed to put Cambridge to the sword, 2-0 Kev. Uh, it's been a good day for you, two goals, perhaps could have had a couple more, could have had a penalty. It's been a pretty eventful day really. Yeah, I think um, overall I think three points is the main thing. I think scoring two, yeah, I'm pleased, but could have had more as you say. I think the first one may be a penalty, I think because I got the shot off still, you never give it. But I'll take two goals and a 2-0 win all day long. And uh, l looking at the, the gentlemen that have got beside you, they've uh, helped swell the crowd today. They've come all the way from Milan. Um, do you want to explain why you're here, guys? Yeah, it's because uh, five, or six, uh, five or six years ago, we started to play with FIFA. Yeah. And we selected a random team, and it was Morkham, of course. And is that, why was that? Why did you select Morkham? Because the logo is amazing. <laughs> yeah, the, the stamp is amazing. Uh, we start every year to play always with Mori Kane. I never use Messi or Ronaldo, always Kev. Always <laughs> Alisson. <laughs> always Alisson, yes. And we won the Champions League with Mori Kane on FIFA. And so here we are. It was an amazing day. So you were saying you're the smart brother, he's the good looking one. Yeah, he's the look, good looking one. He looks like Marquisio, the Juventus <laughs> finder. <laughs> so what are your thoughts on seeing you've come today, you've met Kev before the game. Uh, and as people will see on the highlights, Kev, you had made a bit of a promise to these two guys, didn't you? Yeah, and, um, I spoke to them before the game and I said they were score. I had one of them feelings today, I said they were score, I'll come and see them. But unfortunately for me, first goal, I ran away, slipped, looked up and they're not in the seats where they promised me they'd be. Uh, there he was coming out the door with a pie and a pint. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so I had to score another and obviously go and find them. And that's a, that's a good bit of film. So, looking at you two guys, tell me about the day you've had today. Oh, it was an amazing day. We we wake up very early. We take a train. We we arrive at the stadium and we we make a tour with Mark and we see the changing room. We speak about the bo with the boss. We met our hero. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not forget the um, when they've got the train today. They've walked an hour from Lancaster to the ground. If they'd, I didn't know, I'd arrange something to obviously get them sorted. Now I've got them. A, they're not walking an hour back, so we've got them a lift back home. To the train station. Yeah. So, so carry on. So we we met a lot of funny people, a lot of lovely people. I love this atmosphere. It's really familiar. It's really a really warm day. The weather is, was freezing, but <laughs> but the people <laughs> was really warm. So the match was fantastic. He he scored two a couple of goals. Uh, one we we lost on <laughs> the the celebration. But the second celebration we, we had with him. Yeah. And so, fantastic day. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you very much. So, what, what we need, Kev, is we need to, these, these two brothers to go back to Milan and come back. I need them every week now. Exactly. Don't <laughs> yeah. I need them to come. Might be a bit expensive. Like, I see the club consulted upstairs, but if they yeah. come every week, we little lucky charms and get a few goals. So, I might chip in and give them half of my goal bonus and see if put it towards a flight for the next home game. <laughs> <laughs> okay. yeah. Well, obviously, we're, you know, AC Milan, red and black. Yes, Rossinieri, us, red and black. So it's, uh, we need to twin with AC Milan. Yeah, maybe. Uh, and obviously, Kev, you could end your career at San Siro. Oh, that'd be nice, wouldn't it? Rolling back these with Baresi and Maldini. Georgie Ware. Yeah, well, actually, if you play, if, you could, the you, you'd be the fittest one in the veterans game if you played now, <laughs> after today, wouldn't you? I don't know, I'd like to be, like, I hope so. Hey, well, you were still there at the 95th minute chasing it down, weren't you? That's the main thing, innit? All right. Yeah, finally, guys, wait, have you had a pie yet, Kev? I've just had one before, yeah. All right, sound. And what, it was what, did you, what did you think of the pies? Yeah, it's very good. What did you have? Uh, the meat and potato one. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> the meat and potato one, yeah. Okay. Chicken's the best. Chicken. Chicken. Okay. Chicken's the best. I never tried. The chef says he, he sells them in Harrods now, in London. Yes? Yeah. Okay. But Next time. <laughs> no and chance. A, fi final thing, uh, you got a, you got a, your prizes, man of the match. What have you done with that, Kev? I've gave it to these these two guys. Obviously, come a long way and support not just me. They're supporting the club, aren't they? And um, so I thought it'd be a nice little gesture to give them a little little bottle of champagne for on the way home. They can have it on the train on the way home. Yes, <laughs> I think that's, good. <laughs> that's a nice, nice present. Yeah, it's a fantastic story. Obviously, we've been through the mill in the last three months. I know, you know, as staff and players and fans, it's been a really tough time. And this is a lovely, really, lovely way to end what's been a fantastic day for all of us. So, thanks for coming, guys. And Kev, well done, man of the match. Cheers, thanks boys. for all. Thank You're you. welcome. Thanks. Thank you. Nice Thank to meet you, anyway.
Bye. Bye. Cheers. That's a wrap. <laughs>